home. First and foremost, call her love. Yahweh Bashim, Yahusha Bashim, and Kadash. The blonde is that apostles of Great Millstone. And show warm to the Yakim out there on the highways and byways. Honest to you, brothers, that's pushing this word diligently, faithfully, and in truth. And show warm to you, few sisters, listening in silence to the spirit and power of our Lord Yahweh Bashim, Yahusha. So the thing is, um, revenge. When it comes to revenge and things like that, you know, it never gets old. At the end of the day, you know, revenge, it just never gets old. And even our, even with the most high, you know, because um, if you commit a sin, um, you're going to get paid back for it. You know, it may not happen right, right away, you know, at the time when you committed the sin, you know, it may not happen right away. The most I may not get you right away, but eventually he'll get you. You know, real quick before I get to this, let me just um, prove that real quick in Exodus. Yeah, here it is. Uh, this is um, Exodus 20 and, um, and verse um, 5. And it reads, Thou shalt not bow down. Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them, nor serve them. For I am the Lord thy God, and I am a jealous and I am a jealous God, visiting the iniquity of the fathers upon the children unto the third and fourth generation that hate me. So yeah, so when you go off, you know, you may not get punished right then and there, but when you come back in reincarnation, that's when you're gonna serve out your judgment, you know? So it's no different, you know? Because the Mosai requires that which is past, which I'm about to get right now in um, Ecclesiastes, the third chapter and the 15th verse. You know, so everything is required. And let me just make a real observation of it real quick. Um, right here. See, look at this, you know, look at the lynching of our people, you know, here, here it is, a Jake being sold right here, you know, getting auctioned off, being sold, you know, the chains, the whippings, look at this, picking cotton, you know. Look at that. You see? Look at this shit right here. You know, this is all required. You know? All of this stuff is all required. You 
you know. Look at that. You know, look at the hangings and stuff like that. They hung our people. You know, so all of this stuff is required. No, look at this. See that? You know, all of this stuff is required. Look at this. Look at look at, look at all of this. You know. Look at that. See. Look at these hangings, and look how proud these Edomites are. You think this is just gonna go unpunished? You know, you think this is just gonna just go go unpunished? All of this stuff. So this is all required. You know, the, all of this stuff is required, you know? So this is just an illustration, a visual il illustration on, you know, what took place. And, you know, they tell us to forget about it or whatever and get over it. That was a long time ago. But we're not going to get over it because your blood is required too, you know? Your blood is also required as well. All right, so Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 15, and it reads, That which has been is now, and that which is, that, that which to be has already been, and the Most High requires that which is past. You see, so the Most High requires all of this, all of this stuff right here, all of this, all, all this lynching, all this hell right here that, that we had to, we had to suffer, we had to go through. And not just us as, as you know, the so-called Negroes and, you know, you know the, the Southern Kingdom, but also you Northern Kingdom too. You went through atrocities too like this, you know. Like you Gadites, you know. You, um, you so-called, you Hispanics, you know. You went through, you went through this, you went through this thing, you went through this kind of stuff as well. Because we're all the same people. Because scripture says that, you know, the children of Judah and the children of Israel were oppressed together. So we were oppressed together by this devil. So this devil, he has to pay for this, you know, he has to pay for these atrocities, you know, and he's going to pay. Because like the saying goes, there's a payday someday, you know. So the Lord requires all of this. So let's get, um... Let's get a Isaiah chapter 14, verse 21. So this is the book of Isaiah chapter 14, verse 21. And it reads, Prepare slaughter for his children and for the iniquity, prepare slaughter for his children for the iniquity of their fathers that they, that they do not, that they do not rise nor possess the land nor fill the faces nor fill the faces of the world with cities you know so the, the Lord is saying prepare slaughter for his children and for the iniquity of their fathers you see because what they would like to say is oh that wasn't me oh it wasn't me but it was you because it was your forefathers you benefited from it 
this was a, this was from your forefathers. Your forefathers did all of this atrocity, so now you're gonna pay for it. All right, you're gonna you're gonna pay a heavy price, you know, for all this iniquity, you know. So it's time is is a payday someday. All right. Because it's righteous, we're gonna re recompense the tribulation, which is here. And oh, let, let's get a uh, Second Thessalonians chapter one verse six. Yes, yeah, Second Thessalonians chapter one verse six. Seeing is a righteous thing with the Most High to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. So it's a righteous thing to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. So we're gonna recompense. All this evil that you did onto the nation of Israel, you know, you eat, you know, you so you Edomites, Shut up. you know, you so-called white people. We're gonna recompense all all this evil that you did onto us, and we're gonna do unto you double, because it's a righteous thing. All right, we're gonna do unto you double for what you did. And she check on me. So you gonna get double the payback. You gonna you gonna get paid back double. A thousand times. Would you check on me? So this is um Revelations 18 and 5. And it's not Actually, Revelation 18 and 6. Reward her even as she rewarded you, and do unto her double according to her works. And the cup which thou hast filled, fill unto her double. So we're going to fill the cup unto you double. And you're going to drink that cup, you know. You're going to drink every bit of that cup, and we're going to do unto you double as you did unto us. All right? And that revenge is right around the corner, you know. All of that stuff is right around the corner, all right? So you're going to get paid back, you know, you so-called white people. And also you other nations, too. You're going to get it, too, because you're an accessory to the crime, all right? Pursuant to um, Psalms, the 83rd chapter, all right? So with that, you know, Amanda Dare, you know, about to start camp. It's been a quick hit. Giving all praises and glories due to y'all, Bashim Yashai, Bashim Akwakadash, Shalom.